Hello developers. Today we are diving into exciting topic how to build your own Python summarizer powered by AI. The best part is no API key and no payment to third party services. Everything will run locally and affordably using powerful HFT library. Then what are you waiting for? Let's start it. Hi there, I'm Missy MK. Welcome to the channel. Get ready to explore exciting content, fresh ideas and a whole lot of fun right here every week. Whether you are here to learn, be inspired or just chill, you have come to the right place. So hit the like button, subscribe and let's dive in. A few moments later First thing we have to do is import the pipeline from the HFT library. The pipeline function makes it super easy to use powerful pre-trained AI models like summarization and translation many more. Next we create our summarizer using the pipeline. The task is summarization. So I am mentioning that model called Distilbert CNN126. The model is trained on news article and gives a great short summaries. Next, the revision ID. Revision ID locks the version so future update won't unexpectedly change our result. Next, device is 0. Because of I am using a GPU, I give it as 0. If you are using a only CPU means you have to mention it as minus 1. Here I define the long paragraph which I want to summarize. And next, I pass the text to the summarizer with the maximum length of 50 and I mention the length, minimum length as 25. At the same time, I give do sample as false, which gives you a consistent and deterministic output every time. Next, I just label a print summary to know what's coming next in the console. Finally, we have to extract the result from the summarizer. Basically, the summarizer gives a list of results and I mention the zero to grab the first result only and print it in summary text. The result is clean and greatly summarized than I expected. Using the command line repeatedly can get boring. So now we are going to explore how to turn this into a graphical interface. First, we import some Tkinter and their libraries for our GUI, then pipeline from the HFT. Next, I load our summarizer pipeline as mentioned like previous time. Here I define the summary text function to run when the user click the summarize button. We extract the input text from the text box. If it's empty, I make some warning to show for the user. If the text box is not in tree, I pass it to the AI summarizer. As previous, I control the length of the summary and their consistent. Then we have to clear the output area and insert the new summary result from the model. If anything goes wrong, I code the error handler. Now, we initialize the main graphical interface using Tikindu. I give the title as AI's text summarizer and size of 600 by 500 pixel and I give some light background color. Mm -hmm. 
Next, I added the label prompting the user to enter text followed by the scroll label input area. This makes the long paragraph scrollable. This button runs our summarize text function. Below the button, I add another label for the summary output. The second text area shows the AI generated summary once it's ready. Finally, I call main group to start the graphical interface and keep it run until the user closes. Now we run the file. Finally, there is we created the graphical interface summarizer. I hope this video will help you. If you find value in it, consider subscribe, share and hit the like button.